Well, hi everyone. It's been a while since I've made a video like this, like kind of a ride vlog, something like that. I mean, it's back. Well, there is to say. In a beautiful location. Hope the trail is not that closed. Doesn't have that many containers. But let's give it a ride. Let's see how this thing ends up. Man, for someone that is from Azores that spends the whole year riding in mud, this type of conditions are pretty damn sick. Here you go. Natalia tried to give us the best ride. Dusty ride. Yeah. That tree's close. Yeah. So cool. Just by the fact it is super wide. I mean, who cares? It's so great. Oh, shit. <laughs> Alright, first crash. <laughs> That's loose. That's super loose. Alright. There we go. Whoa, whoa. I put in this section last week and now it is all full of rocks again. Yeah. Ooh, that, those leaves are not, not giving me the grip I want. But that's cool. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. That was close. Yeah. Uh, why is this track so small, man? I could drive this thing some more five minutes or so. Yeah. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Yeah. So, the reason I'm doing this is because I want to find a couple of trails and, and climbs and descend, cool stuff like that, that I can do in, I guess, one and a half, two hours. That is not that far from home. I can just spread along the trail, have some fun, come back home, continue my day. <laughs> Didn't win as planned. On to the second trail. Just an old exit track that was open, I guess, two years ago. Hope it's still opened. Let's check it out. What a beautiful view, by the way. These trees, this scenario is something else. Yeah. I told you. Ah! I told you this thing would be super close. Oh, man. Whoop. Crank it up. Oh. It's good, it's good. Full of leaves, so it's actually not meant to be rough. Almost over the bars, mate. Well, I wasn't expecting that route. Alright. A bit messed up. But, pretty fun. Into the third track of the day, probably my favorite track ever of this course because it is super rocky, it is always dry and the trees and the scenery just keeps on going. Let's go to the right, to the track. Yeah, boy. Pretty loose, pretty good, pretty rocky. the rocket section of the trail. <laughs> oh, my reels. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Super fun. So, up there there's a little hill. There can be it is far from trail, it's far from the trail, but it can be fun. That's the trails, uh, trails, the mini tracks I told you. It seems some kind of fun, I mean, there's some other things inside of that wo those woods, it seem fun. I mean, the more across track is something to forget, I mean, possible for me. Let's try to have some fun. This gravel is not made for bikes. Right here. Just on this 
big boy around. Oh, this grab on him. It don't work out. Uh, Alright, let's give up on this one too. On to the last trail. Let's go. Seems to be pretty close. Oh no. Alright, this gravity plant's hurt. The loose rock section. Alright, this section, this is not that good for the bike frame. This rock just hit the front and just knocked it down. Oh, oh, this is loose. Pretty, pretty much loose. Oh my lord. This is freaking, oh my lord. And then to finish this city ride, just in Parker Barn, just really close to the city, just to give their final pumped up in this big jumps, good flow jumps. I mean, recently some campers just came here, probably just do some campfire, something like that, and then everything burned out. I mean, look at this, this is it's horrible. Everything burned down. I mean, Let's go, final ride of the day, into the jumps. Into the flow trails of Parkour Bano. Here we go. Whoop, 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 whoop. Whoop. And we just did, let me see, 2 hours and 15 minutes, more or less what I wanted, 30k, yeah, 30 kilometers, 2 and 15 minutes, super cool, till the next one.